everybody. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to the show. How are you today? Hope you're doing well. I'm Captain He. Good to have you here. It's Tuesday, um, and it's time for part two of uh, Marvel M Midnight Suns. Yes, um, it's it's the game where. It's a new, it's a new, uh, tale from the Marvel Universe. So, and this is part two of that story. Um, for, for those of you who are, are just joining me, for the first time, I just, um, awakened me, the, uh, the, um, I just awakened the hunter. And, uh, and I, I also just got done talking to Blade outside of the crypt. So let's see how the story evolves from there. I think two days and fire access games did a, a, a good job with this, this story, I'm very pleased, and I can't wait to see how, how the rest of the story evolves from here. Anyway, I'm going to shut up now and, and get back to playing the game again. Thank you for following the, the channel and, and subscribing to me on both YouTube and Twitch. Um, links to, to both to the my Twitch page is on, it's in the description below this video, and links to my YouTube page is found on my Twitch page. But for now, let's, let's get going, shall we? I think we shall. Did I miss something, or did Nico just raise the dead? I definitely helped, but no, that's the one thing I can't do. You were never able to raise the dead. Huh? But she just did. Maybe the hunter wasn't all dead. Hunter? Not sure if you remember me, but we met briefly before. I'm... The witch who called me back from the grave. Told you. Or Nico, but neither works. And this is Robbie Reyes. 
Oh man, never thought I'd be standing next to you. Got quite a rep. I mean, caretakers told us. Stories. That's Ileana. Privet. And I think you already met Blade. Of course. Caretaker has reformed the Midnight Suns. Whoa. How did you... Your power. I can feel it. I always do. So... Welcome home. I guess we... I never left. Right. Well, we can fast forward through the tour then. The Abbey is still, well, you know. The Abbey. Basic stuff. Dorms, war room, library, a few places to chill, and, uh, whatever the hell the forge is. I have to say, for a haunted transient castle raised on the cursed grounds of Old Salem, it's pretty cozy. Of course, that doesn't stop us from adding some improvements. We can all thank Robbie for the Wi-Fi. Oh, and one more thing. We've got some new house guests now. You think we're a fun bunch, just wait until you meet them. Speaking of... We're here. Yeah, okay, spend ten minutes in this place alone, Bruce, then see. Oh, <clears throat> gotta go. Show's about to begin. There isn't time for a refresher, much less that sort of training regime. You'll have to trust that the Hunter's past experience is enough. Taking a big risk with your chosen one. You act as if I'm thrilled with the situation. If you're concerned, then... Prophecies be damned. It's good to see that face again. You look like it was yesterday. And you look... older. How long was I in that crypt, Sarah? No more than a few centuries. You were... missed. Centuries? And what of Lilith? Fallen by your hand. Until now. <clears throat> yeah, so speaking of Lilith... Tony? What? The kid's literally speaking of Lilith. Tony? That's my name. Tony. That's, uh, Carol and Dr. Spooky over there. Here to help. Help with what, exactly? Oh, I don't know. Throwing the magic amulet into the volcano? Smiting the Dragon Mother? You tell us, kid. You are the chosen one, after all. Do you recall anything of that last encounter, child? There was... a voice. The rest is... hazy. Oh, a voice. That's it? A voice? That's what we have to go on? Results of your long crypt sleep, most likely. A minor inconvenience. Everything required to restore those memories is contained within my sanctum. I will simply alert Wanda to prepare the necessary rituals. Straight to voicemail? Some Sorcerer Supreme. Must be mystical interference caused by this little pocket dimension of yours. Perhaps Agatha can help. Allow me. Alato. Whoa, what kind of network you run in there? The all-seeing eye of Ereshkigal who judges. Bound to enchanted Babylonian soul glass. We just call it the mirror table. Wanda! The dark force is pushing against the wards. Steven, where are you? That's impossible. Nothing on Earth could possibly affect those wards. Wanda's in trouble. Wanda is trouble. I'll go. You'll need my help, of course. Then let us make haste, Dr. Spooky. Our hunt begins now. So that was Lilith, huh? She's a real 90s. 
With everything going on right now, we simply cannot afford to lose contact with the Sanctum or Wanda. 1690s, maybe. Hard to believe. Given the fluctuations in the astral spectrum, I should be seeing something. Unless Bruce is right about gamma interference. <laughs> if such a thing could even exist. But the wards have been activated before, and I've never experienced such a reaction. Or perhaps I have simply erased that timeline so as not to affect my own destiny. I am quite efficient with my future and past selves in that regard. Your translucency spell must be failing. Are you ready? The prophecy of the Midnight Sun does not linger, and neither should we. Lilith possesses the Darkhold. If she forced her way into my Sanctum Sanctorum once, I suspect she can do it again. You are a Sorcerer Supreme. Can you not predict her movements? Normally, yes. But since your mother breached the Sanctum, my sense of the future has grown voluminous in nature. Is that another language, or...? Ah, <sighs> fuzzy. My predictions are fuzzy. For the first time as Sorcerer Supreme, I cannot foresee how the future unfolds, and with my apprentice in danger, we cannot tarry. I understand the urgency. Your apprentice is in grave danger, yes? Wanda is no mere apprentice. She is the Scarlet Witch, one of the strongest magical practitioners I have encountered. But she hasn't channeled such power on her own since... Never mind. One crisis at a time. I do not doubt Wanda's capability, but without my predictive acumen, I cannot bolster the wards should she need it. Still, the wards are woven into the Sanctum's very essence. They should hold. In any case, all will be revealed with time. I suggest we make use of it while it still functions. We should hurry. As much as I'd love to hear a first-hand account of your exploits, time is of the essence, I'm afraid. I can't help but feel a tinge of impatience. It is my home under siege, after all. What is this? Interesting. Wanda can maintain the wards, I'm certain of that. But perhaps we shouldn't linger? About time. 
Not just about time. Mr. Brooks, time, space, reality, the building blocks of magic. All must be constant for my portals to work properly. Yet as we now know, that is no longer the case. We've heard. Several times. Otherwise, I would still be hunting dread maidens in my sleep. Indeed. And while I certainly appreciate the view of this vista, I fail to see how it will hasten our return to the Sanctum. Magic is the answer. No, as I've just stated, magic is the problem. Your magic is... not ours. The ground you are standing on exists within two worlds. A mystical anchor point to Ileana's realm that allows her to... Well, I'll just let her show you. So young, of course. You think this is crazy? Wait until you see Manhattan. From here, magic can open gateways to just about anywhere on our planet and beyond. We don't want to risk punching through the ward. We know the wards of protection are still in place. For now. I suggest we hurry. resistance between you and the Sanctum. Looks can be deceiving, I'm afraid. There's no way these foot soldiers are behind the disruption of the wards of protection.
to mention your mother. Apparently, she's promiscuous. seems to be growing. Let's assume that's not a good thing. Gemma or not, I feel the hand of my mother at work here. Watch closely. Possibly match your strength.
too weak for this fight. Misguided as they are, remember, Hydra is still human under... Not Lilin. You were saying? The lifeblood of the Mother pumps through our veins. The Mother is eternal. Hydra is eternal. One of bed. itself venom. Until now, a pale imitation of a very heroic young friend of mine. We will feed your ugly tongue to the spider wizard, marinate it in his stomach juices, and eat it with his spleen.
stronger already. This battle requires. of your mother's children so chatty thankfully no Sorcerer Supreme has won the world. Mother tells us to hurry! Gods, what manner of creature are you? Be ready for this thing yet. Might be smarter to pull back until we know what we're up against here. Yes. Surrender. Be eaten. Fill our belly with your tasty fear. I shall fill your belly with my blade, demon. than its fists is its breath. Good. 
I could use some more practice. Mother blesses us with power. Mother blesses us with strength. We protect the mother and are rewarded with your meat. And to think Lilith was a vegetarian. Succeed. You should not have come here. Your friends cannot help you. Mother may have claim on your soul. But your brains shall be ours. Come 
remarkable how well Hydra manages to attract new recruits despite decades of ineptitude. dealing with lackeys now. No escape from me, demon. Hold up. We don't know what we're dealing with yet. <laughs> Friendly. Seemed like you folks could use a hand, Doc. <coughs> Spider-Man! Jeez, Eddie, what happened to you? That's sort of a horrifyingly terrible new look. The tongue was gross enough, but... Whoa! Someone is extra touchy today. We will rip your face off and suck the marrow from your bones! Always nice to see you too, buddy. So, I'm thinking your friends here could use a little break. How about I take Eddie here for his afternoon walk? <laughs> Don't worry, Doc. That's just his way of saying he cares! <laughs> Congratulations. New world or not, some things remain unchanged. The look. What look? Boldly charging headfirst into the jaws of your enemy. Courageously risking the lives of yourself and your teammates. Just to play the hero. This is the Fire Dragon all over again. Fire Dragoon. My memories may be fragmented, but as I recall... I killed the bastard. And all it cost was a village. Ah, of course! I see it now. The look! Cut him some slack. It wasn't that simple. It never is. Which is why I sent you to help. If Spider-Man hadn't come along today, we could have lost far more than... Than the Sanctum? Or Wanda? She means I could have died. Again, putting an end to her eternal crusade against my mother. You've been through a lot. For now, it's enough that you all made it back in one piece. More or less. We'll talk more later. Get some rest. Okay. I'm gonna call it here for the day. I'll be back tomorrow for, for another part of Marvel, Marvel's Midnight Suns. 
thank you very much for coming and clicking on the video and watching. Don't forget to give a thumbs up and of course subscribe to the channel, both channels, and to be to to be exact. I really appreciate it. I hope you have a good day and I'll see you tomorrow afternoon. Bye for now. Thanks again, guys.